Hey guys, welcome. So in today's video, we are going to solve the permission denied issue in GitHub. And I have faced this issue quite a lot. So hopefully you're facing the same issue and you've come to the right place so that we can fix it with just one step, which is really simple and which is really easy to fix. So the issue basically is permission denied to your Git and unable to access your GitHub repo. So this could happen due to many reasons, but the main reason that this one's happening to me is because I have two GitHub account, which is my personal GitHub account and my code easy GitHub account. So in this Visual Studio code right here, currently I have my personal account logged in. So when I try to access my code easy GitHub account and try to push any changes to my code easy GitHub account, it says my permission is denied because I am not logged in as code easy. So to fix this issue, what you need to do is go to your search bar and type credential manager and you hit enter. Now, once you're in here, you click on windows credentials. And over here somewhere you will see your GitHub login detail or with your GitHub username, password. So what you need to do is currently you can see that I am logged in as my personal account. Now, since I'm trying to push my, this changes to my code, code easy GitHub account, it's not giving me the permission. So what I need to do is I need to at first remove this from this credential manager. So once I remove this, now what I need to do is I need to go to my GitHub, the GitHub account where you want to push your changes. Now I want to push my changes to code easy and then I'll log in my code easy GitHub account in the browser. If you have your personal or some other GitHub account logged in, then you might face issues. So whatever account you want to push your changes to, you have to log in that account and you go to Visual Studio Code and then you add that address to your GitHub repo so we'll just git remote add the github repo url and hit enter now you can see that github remote origin already exists so i'll try to push my changes to master now when i try to push my changes to master it will ask me to log in now since i am already logged in in my browser what i can simply do is now simply click on sign in with my browser and it will open a new window and it has automatically signed in to my code easy github account and you can see we have successfully pushed our changes to our github account now when i go and refresh it you can see that cha the change is now visible in github so if you are facing this same issue then it is highly likely that you have two github accounts and you are logged in as a different github account in your visual studio code and that is why it is not giving you the permission to commit to changes. So there might be a different ways to fix this issue, but the easiest and most convenient way that I have found is to go and delete your credentials because you can always log in back and you don't have to worry about anything else. So that's it guys. That's how you fix your permission denied issue. I hope this video was helpful. And if you have any other issues that you're facing, then you can always comment down in my video and then I will try to solve those issues and make a new video. Thank you for watching and I'll see you in the next one.